place. A lot of money in scrap. Yeah, well, if you say what you like, I'll have a word with him for you. I mean, you'll be able to afford it, the prices you're charging. <laughs> Look, are you here to waste my entire day? Are you going to tell me what you've got for me? Ah, I think it's a golden star for this lucky boy. Mail. Fitting your missing Mr Tate's description. He's been spotted in the vicinity of his mother-in-law's old house on several occasions. Fitting the description. So, basically, a white bloke, tall, average build, brown hair. Yeah, cut and dry as that. Yeah, I thought you might say that. This is why I took the liberty of uh, getting these made up in glorious Technicolor. Just for you. It could be him, I guess. Couldn't you get any closer? Nah, I didn't want to spook him. If he's as slippery as you say, well, I thought it'd be better, you know, softly, softly. Right, so what now? Well, and this is a good bit, your money has been around a lot. So often, in fact, that he's got himself a favourite coffee shop. Lovely old woman who runs it. Salt of the earth. And? I managed to nick one of his discarded cups. Gave it to me mate down the lab to run the DNA. All we need now is a match. I don't know about that. Hey, I'm not looking for you to chop off a finger. I just need you to provide a few airs. A couple of nail clippings, maybe a bit of saliva from the bouncing baby boy. And we'll get the lab results to you, look at your split. All part of the package. Hey, listen. You wanted hard proof one way or the other. And you can have it. You've just got to follow the science. No point in looking at me like that. I'm not trying to poison you. Oh, watch where you're stepping. He's got banana everywhere. Apart from inside his tummy. Takes after his granny, then, does he? Messy eater. Yeah, we have to take a bib with us everywhere we go. She's such a slob. Oh, hi, Kim. <laughs> yeah, you're a good one. <laughs> Oh, look, don't worry, I'm going to clear this all up. Either that will burn the house down, might be quicker. Mm. You look done in. Oh, yeah, cheers. Just want to have a soak in the bath and stop stinking of rotten fruit. A fat chance of that with Mr Fussy Pants, Emperor of the Universe and the Wide Awake Club. Look, um, I'll clear up for you if you like. Really? Yeah, yeah, it'll only take a minute. I'll look after his lordship, too, if you want to go and get a bath. Well, I was going to phone Amelia, see if she can sit with him for an hour. I have had one myself, you know. And he's all right, isn't he? Little Bobby Dazzler. Oh, you're an absolute superstar. I will, uh, won't be long. Yep, yeah, no rush. Take your time. We'll be as right as rain, won't we? Hey, you be a good boy, yeah? I'll try my best. <laughs> Do you know, I thought I'd come home to find you dealing with some sort of crisis. Heroically beating back dragons from the gate. Yeah, I'm sorry I was uh, babysitting little Thomas. Gabby's worn out. She's always worn out, which is remarkable, considering how little she does. But you're not telling me that you were so overwhelmed with the baby you couldn't send me a message? Or respond to the several I sent you? I was going to call you back, but I don't know where I've left my phone. I will make it up to you. Oh, no, you won't. You shall leave me my bubble bath and this very large brandy well alone, if you know what's good for you. Hey, it's me. Yeah, it's done. I'm not proud of myself, but... Yeah, it's done. Right. Well, get your finger out. Let's start to see some results. You have got 24 hours. I'm not paying you for maybes. 